a quick video on frost susceptibility and these eucalypt seedlings. These are all um, just finished their first growing season from seed, so these are all about six months old or nine months. It's um, middle of June, so middle of winter in New Zealand. Um, just had our first real frost. So here, coldest we'll ever get here is about minus four. Um, coldest we've had so far this year is probably minus one. About ten days ago I put up a graph shortly of um, temperatures this year. So had a couple of frosts. It's been quite late frosts. Um, just going to have a look at the different species. I don't really bother. I used to put the seedlings under cover. Haven't really bothered lately as most of these um, seem pretty tough. Haven't really had much frost damage. Um, just going to have a look at what is susceptible and what isn't. Uh, most of them are pretty tough. So I'll start with the one, one that is is regnans. This is a regnans here. Quite a big one. Um, probably one of the taller seedlings here. It's from the PP2 pot. So you see the leaves are quite um, browny red. These are quite badly frost damaged. Especially the lower leaves. Funny thing is when these get frost damaged often the higher, more tender, or the newer growth is actually tends to be unaffected, so this one here will be fine. It'll survive. Just often um, they lose their lower leaves. So I found especially regnans seems to be pretty susceptible to that. Um, and just some particular individuals that one there is browned up. Those lower leaves will probably fall off. Um, what else have I got here? Alright, I've got my helper out here now, Archer. Say hello. Hi. You can plug your channel if you want. Yeah. What's it called? Can't remember. <laughs> <laughs> so on the left, that's one individual of Regnans. On the right, that's another one, that's frost damaged one. So, same species, but um, obviously been affected a little differently. Uh, you can put those back now. Well, I can't really. Well, just stick them on the ground. So, no, just put them down. So the other species here, most of these are fine. There's, um, there's lots of... Yes, that's fine. Thanks for that. Now? Yes, please. Um, gl uh, globulus, nightens, um, fastigata, glaucusens, snaria, uh, delrimpliana. What else? Ovata. Pretty tough. Never seen any get frost, frost damaged. Um, blue coxalon over the back here. These are also pretty tough. Never seen them get frost damaged. Got a fastigata there. That's um, fastigata seem to be a bit more tough than regnans, although they're a bit slower growing. That one there is uh, very healthy. Even, um, I've got some smaller nitens here that I've just potted up more recently and you can see I've given them a good dose of uh, nitrogen, they're all very very deep green and uh, absolutely no damage to those whatsoever, so yeah, they're pretty tough.